Hello, thank you for joining me today. What I'm going to be doing today is just an update on my channel and on the sticker board over there. Um, <clears throat> it's been about a month, just over a month since I updated the sticker board and I've had a few come in since the last time I did it. So I'm just going to update them. And today's the Friday the 23rd of March. Uh, and I'd just like to say a big thank you to all my old subscribers and all my new subscribers. As of today, I've got 432 subscribers. Uh, so it's climbing up slowly to that 500 mark. And like I say, when I get to about 500, I'm just going to do a little giveaway. But uh, as you can see in the background there, I've uh, changed my bandsaw. I bought a second hand bandsaw. It's the ELU EBS 3501. Uh, model A, if that anything. Um, I paid sixty pounds for it. Uh, it's a lot bigger than my old one. My old one was just a little hobby band, so as you've seen in my previous videos, I've actually got rid of that now, and I've used that to pay for this one. And uh, I've just ordered a new blade for it, so I should be receiving that probably three or four days. But anyway. Just gonna get on with this, uh, shooting out the stickers now. Uh, the first one, does you in no particular order? I'm just reading. I've got them wrote down on a piece of paper. I'm just reading them off this. So the first one is uh, Paul at the Wood King. Uh, he hasn't got a YouTube channel, but he shows his work on Instagram. He does some real nice wood turning and makes pens. Uh, check out his Instagram feed. I'll leave all the links in the description down below. Uh, like I say, he makes some, he shows his work and he, he shows some really nice looking stuff what he makes. Uh, the next one is Sharpie's Workshop. Um, Paul works out of his garage and makes some upcycled, some really nice things. His latest video he's just made his wife a little step stool out of scaffolding boards, which was a really nice build. I did enjoy watching that. It was uh, quite entertaining. But, uh, I'll leave it at that. Just go on his channel, give him a bit of love. Next is uh, Carl from Straw White Workshop. Uh, is a relatively relatively new channel with some build videos and unboxing and review videos. Uh, his videos are very well put together, well, well edited, and uh, they're a pleasure to watch. So same again, jump on his channel, give him a watch. The next one is a, a, a favourite of mine for watching at the minute as well. Uh, John Clothier. The work John creates is nothing more than a work of art, in, in my eyes, looking at it. I'm, I'm not a wood turner, but to see somebody doing wood turning as well as what John does is remarkable. Uh, he goes into a lot of depth of the techniques he's doing and how he does things. Uh, he makes some beautiful wall hangings, bowls and pens uh, and does work with resin mixed in as well. I'll just leave it at that, jump on his channel. Check him out. Uh, the next one is Matt from Badger Workshop. He makes some nice things as well. Just made an LED lamp, which was brilliant. Uh, he also does other making and review on things, various bits and pieces. Check on his channel. Uh, this one is Mike, MSA Wood Creations. The next one is Nick from Bowers Craft Wood Turning. It's a relatively new channel, he's got a few videos on there. Uh, he does some real nice wood turning work and bowl making. Uh, he's just made a nice bowl on there, on his latest build. And he's uh, does some resin blanks for pens. Does some proper nice stuff on there. Uh, this other one isn't a YouTube channel but he shows his stuff on uh, Instagram it's Daniel at 328 Joinery uh, he shows pictures of his work on there I'll just let you jump on his channel if you want and, and check out some of his stuff uh, yeah this next channel is uh, a relatively new channel it's Emil from the Practical Engineer but all I can say is wow on his latest build I really enjoyed watching it, it was well put together, well edited uh, and it was amazing. Go and check it out. Well worth a watch. The next one 
This again is another new channel, Tinkineering Rob, his name. Uh, he's just made a 3D model for his action camera. Uh, it turned out really good. Uh, he's made it so that he can keep it on charge as he's filming, obviously, and you can access the ports to get the memory card out without having to keep taking it in and out of the cases. It turned out really good. Check on his channel. I'll put the links in the description. Uh, and then we've got another favourite I like to watch at a minute, Martin, that uh, MG makes. He makes some really interesting things out of reclaimed pallet wood. He just made his own depth gauge for doing like the depths in grooves and uh, how are your, your blade coming up. Uh, it turned out really good. Uh, good editing on it and it's a good laugh. Uh, so I'll go on his channel and check him out. The next one is Small Workshop for YouTube Makers. This is a page on Facebook. Uh, it's a relatively small group. Now, some of the things on, on the page, uh, you must be a maker, a DIYer, craft related or art related, and you must be active on YouTube to be a member of the group. Uh, and all I can say is, there's a great set of people on there. I think there's I don't think we've got 70 members on there at the minute, uh, both male and female, everybody gets involved and, you know, jumps on each other's work and praises each other's work and helps other, everyone out. Uh, they're very friendly people on there, and I'd like to think that I've made some good friends on there from being on the group. Uh, and as everybody who sent me stickers and subscribed to me, I'd like to give you all a big thank you. And a big thumbs up. Hope I can get to that 500. And uh, that's about it for the updates and stickers and everything. I think I have got some more stickers coming in, but I'll update them in another month now. A month from now. Uh, and we'll go from there. Yeah, if you've got any comments or questions you'd like to ask, or you'd like to leave me a comment, put them in the section down below. I do answer all my comments, uh, I try to answer everybody back to the best my brain will let me, but uh, yeah, thank you for that, uh, like I said, thanks to all my subscribers, and we'll see you again soon.